Hi, my name is Paul Avery. I'm a product training engineer with Uscalo America. This is the first e-learning video of a series discussing DriveWorks EZ version 10. In this video, I will show you where to find and download the DriveWorks EZ software. We will also review the installation process. Acquiring the DriveWorks EZ software begins with a visit to www.yaskawa.com. Hover over the word Products on the top menu bar. The drop-down menu will offer a link to the Industrial Software Tools webpage, so we will select that. From the Industrial Software Tools, we can follow the link to the DriveWorks EZ page. Click Request Software, and then fill out the online request form. Notice that this is for the standard version. DriveWorks EZ Pro requires a unique serial number and a password during installation. If you complete this entire ELM series and demonstrate proficiency by completing remote demo exercises, then you will be issued the pro-level credentials. We will discuss pro certification further in a future video in this series. Once the form is complete, click Submit. You should receive an email just about instantaneously. If not, be sure to check your spam folder. The email contains a link to download the software, as well as the installation ID and password. Click the link to download the zip file. Extract the contents of the zip, run the EXE. During the installation, when you get to the step asking for your ID number, you'll need to check the email you received. Click Next and do the same for the password. Proceed to finish the installation. Installing Yaskawa's DriveWorks EZ is simple and straightforward, but a word of warning. Some company laptops will have restrictions placed on them by their company's IT department. DriveWorks EZ may need a user with administrative privileges to install the software on some PCs with restrictions that prohibit proper installation. If you run into issues during installation, you may want to contact your IT for assistance even before you contact Yaskawa Technical Support. Let's confirm the software was installed properly by opening it. Thank you for watching this e-learning module. The next module in this series will feature an introduction to the DriveWorks EZ software.